Now talking a little bit more about some tactical things with the channel. How do you organize the channel? Well, we have playlists of different cakes. So we just think of ways as we get more and more content to add new playlists or change up the playlist. People can know exactly what they want to see and then just get sucked in and watch, <laughs> you know, <laughs> over and over, which is great. Now, Whitney, yeah. I'm, you've got three channels, so we've got yeah. a lot to work with. Yeah. Uh, but I'm curious if you could speak a little bit to uploading schedules. I usually try to post uh, a hair video on the weekend. I usually try to post a weekly vlog now on the weekends. And then the other channel just kind of fits in wherever it fits in. Scheduling is like so big and I know that it's really helpful and it's what your audience can rely on. They can go to your channel at a certain time on a certain day. That's like the ultimate goal for me. We constantly get asked to put out more than one video a week, but we know in reality we cannot do that. We would have to give up sleep. So we've never tried to do it because we're like, once we do it, if we take it back, they're going to be upset. I think consistency just breeds trust. So we did very much what uh, Yolanda did on her channel. Our viewers know Monday and Thursday, you're going to get a brand new video. But I would definitely say one thing is really important when you're setting that schedule for yourself, make sure it's realistic mm -hmm. and within, within the parameters you can maintain. Uh, because when you start breaking that consistency, when you start breaking that trust, you know, viewers can start to get upset. I have to co-sign what you said because when I went from daily vlogging to weekly vlogging, they, was very, they were very upset. Consistency is really important. And even if you can't pick an, an exact date, just always be there. Just try to get the content out there. And if, if you mess up on a video, just put something else out there. Like just let them know, oh, hey, I messed up. So let's do a Q&A or something like that. Just always have something out there for your audience to consume.